the nose. The nose is a protruding vertebrate that houses the nostrils which admit and expel air for respiration. Inside the nose is an area of specialized cells which are responsible for smelling and are a part of the olfactory system. The nose also performs the function of conditioning the inhaled air, warming it and making it more humid. The nose consists of two parts. The external nose, which protrudes from the center of the face, and the nasal cavity, which is divided by septum into right and left nasal chambers, and are the passageways for air. The nasal cavity has an important role in breathing. The roof of the nasal cavity is narrow and the floor is concave from side to side, respectively. The external nose is generally in the shape of a pyramid. It is composed of bones and lined by a mucous membrane. Its base is separated by two elliptical orifices, the nares, separated from each other by the columna or the column. The upper part of the nose is supported by the nasal bones called the bridge. The olfactory mucosa and the sinuses are within and behind the nose. The mucous membrane lines the nasal cavities and is thickest and most vascular over the nasal concave. It is also thick over the septum, but it is very thin in the meatuses on the floor of the nasal cavities and in several sinuses. The accessory sinuses or air cells of the nose are the frontal ethmoidal, sphenoidal, and maxillary. They vary in size and form from person to person and are fined by ciliated mucous membrane. The nose is an organ of smell in the body. The nose is an area of specialized cells which are responsible for smelling. The nose consists of two parts, the external nose and a nasal cavity. The nasal cavity has an important role in breathing. The external nose is generally in the shape of a pyramid. The olfactory mucosa and the sinuses are within and behind the nose. The mucous membrane lines the nasal cavities. The accessory sinuses or air cells of the nose include the frontal, ethmoidal, sphenoidal, and maxillary. The hairs inside the margins of the mares prevent large particles from entering the lungs during breathing.